Yo, world, this is Fat Man DD1. Wow, that was too inspirational. All right, check it out. So right now, MKX, somebody said, hey, can you talk about and review MKX? I was like, yeah, the game didn't come out yet, but I can talk about the videos that I've seen. And big shouts to Mortal Kombat community. Uh, I hope you guys don't flag and sue me because I'm using footage that everybody else out there is using. Uh... If you are, I'm going to deadass be mad and be like, fuck y'all niggas. I really want to use this stuff because this is some good kick-ass shit. So let's get into it with, you know, a little Raiden versus the King of the Underworld on Netherrealm. Whatever. This shit looks nice. Mortal Kombat X. Raiden versus Kong Hayahala Kama. Hey everyone, I'm Ed Boon from Netherrealm. I'm sorry, this guy is really ugly in the face. Ed Boom needs to like learn some martial arts or lose some weight because he's scary. And we're excited to share the return of a classic character to Mortal Kombat X. Classic. Raiden. Raiden's been with Mortal Kombat from the very beginning, and we've had a lot of fun updating him for MKX. And today we're going to give you a taste of all three of his character variations. As the Guardian of Earthrealm, Raiden has a long history of conflict with Outworld, so it's only <laughs> natural that he face off against its current Emperor, Cobra Why Khan. Like that? Mor Mortal Khan? No chance, Thunder or Mortal Khan? Thunder blots out the sun. Temporarily. I like that. The Thunder God variation enhances Raiden's... When they talk, it's pretty good, because they know each other in their background. That's what I like from video games. Plus, I like that Thunder blots out the sun. I was like... Only for a little bit, man. But a blackout is forever. <laughs> lightning attacks, allowing him to string together longer combos and do more damage. Raiden's whooping his ass. Look at that. Mm, Raiden's kicking it. There's a move in here that I was like, that's gonna be a combo. In his displacer variation, Raiden gains new teleportation moves. His teleportation is like his teleportation is gonna be hack. Uh let's let's not get too cocky with that. Raiden's teleportation is gonna be hack. If you use a teleporting character like Mr. Yoga from Street Fighter, teleporting is hack. You can teleport across the field, fuck up your opponent, and sneak attack. Sneak attack, blah 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 special bam. Contain and more mobile in combat. Bam. That dispersal move is going to be a hack move because once you disperse and combo, I think you're basically whooping your opponent's ass. Let's keep going. Sorry for the lag, if there is any. I like the way that you can throw objects now. Ooh. He's about to kill him. Finally, Storm Lord Raiden can create Storm lightning traps with wide areas. Good. It means you can't jump and hit your opponent. It means you gotta like slide or something. Mmm, send to the ground. Shot him over there. It's over. Disperse. Ooh, back kick. Finish him. I think he just stole his soul, bro. Oh my god. So that was nasty. Alright, now we got something that you might enjoy. Reptile versus... Yeah. I have no quarrel. Okay. The, for some reason, the voice actor, if you know the voice actor of Ichigo, that dude is everywhere. Me and my friends heard him everywhere. He played Zero and um, Marvel's Capcom 3. He's everywhere. And it sounds like him, but a little more deeper and older. It, it, it doesn't, but that's just me. Tell me what you think. I will tear your flesh. I now have a quarrel with you. So Reptile is a far away and up close character. You don't want to get even that far from Rattel, because what she just did is just shot you in the goddamn face like a little pussy. Look at that combo. Combo, combo. Another big shout out one more time to Mortal Kombat community. Bam. Bam. He's just killing you. Oh, he's good ass in your face. Come on, man. I'd be upset if this nigga's fast. Yes, come back. No, what the fuck are you doing? What the fuck are you, what are you doing? What are you doing? Uh, it's over. Call your doctor. You're done. Spit ass in your face. Ooh. 
that was nasty. That was the nastiest thing in the world. I hated it. Now, this is another trailer. I might love this. is the second Mortal Kombat trailer. And yeah, I might like this. Where have you been, Kung Lao? Kung Lao has been, I think, to me, we show, we seen him. Oh, look, you're gonna get a good look at him. Finally found him. All right. Where have you been, Kung Lao? Oh, I was trying to see what you like. Finally found a way to kill me. Yeah. I know of many. Too many ways to knock your ass out. Hmm. It's over. They're taking it from a really high place. Watch when you see Kung Lao. He looks older. That means he was like training for a long time somewhere. After MK9. Mm. It's over. Wait for it. Wait for it. That's it. Kung Lao knows like Wing Chun because that's some shit you've seen in Wing Chun, like martial arts movie, and that he pulled it off super quick, super fast. That's what excited the crap me. One more time, a little slow rewind for everybody out there. Crack through his skull. Right there. He's collapsed. Nigga. Finish him. It's over. Who's next? Man, fuck you, Goro. Hated your bitch ass. I fucked you up so easily in MK9. Nigga, what now? What now? What? 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 What if they were gonna make an MK11? <sighs> Cause the X was perfect. So soon later, well, like probably 2020, I'll make an MK11. It'll be amazing. But right now, everybody, what do you think of MK9? 10. MK10. If you played MK9, what do you think the storyline is gonna be? Are you thinking they're going to take it to another place with this? What do you got that takes this to the next level? And to me, I'm loving it. So, what characters you want to see in this game? When are they going to show Liu Kang? And also, who's next? Peace.